Time check 10 p.m. and the streets of Kavali are dotted with the ladies of the night. Slowly by slowly, they stream in to take their positions. Well aware of the risks involved in this business, they are determined to carry on. 26-year-old Barbara, not real names, says she has been on the streets since the age of 18 and she was lured into this trade by her friends. She says on a good day, she gets close to seven customers and four out of seven prefer not to use protective gear. She says although she's HIV positive, the amount of money their customers pay not to use protection is temptingly high. Barbara is not alone. Many prostitutes talked to in the area shared similar revelations. The prostitution trade in the area is compounded by the truck drivers who consistently make stopovers in the districts entering and leaving the country. It is against this backdrop that Katuna Maps, a community-based organization together with Reproductive Health Uganda, are trying to reverse this trend. If they are not well handled, they can decide to spread the infection. That means we need to really focus on the maps, on these girls and on these men. They can decide to go viral and uh, they spread the infection anyhow. Sarah Chomujish of Katuna Maps says in the fight against HIV, the prostitutes must be brought on board. You've heard one of the men say that at times uh, these ladies know that they're HIV positive and when they don't tell you, they don't disclose to you, you end up having unsafe sex. And if she doesn't want, maybe she wants you to have live sex, she gives you the virus and you take the virus home to your wife and children and you end up, uh, the, the, the sexual network end up increasing. But if these girls tell you and they are, edu they are sensitized and they know they're HIV positive and they are on ARVs and they know their rights and they are, they are sensitized and they are empowered, they will always demand for safer sex. The prostitutes also find it hard to access the necessary HIV drugs and information. There are for Katuna Maps and Reproductive Health Uganda are trying to rally the district's attention. But for us as RHU and uh, Katuna Maps as implementing partners in the district, our role is to, um, we will continue to empower the communities to demand for um, their rights and also demand for health services in the district. But also we have to follow up on the commitments that uh, the district put forth. However, Patrick Tumusimi, the DHO of Kavari, says they are working on making accessibility of ARVs much easier to prostitutes and those in need. to increase access uh, to HIV, AIDS services, prevention services, to, to those people who need them. The district's officials are also working on taking most of these prostitutes off the streets by engaging them in viable business ventures. They can form groups of between uh, 10 to 13 people. They identify the kind of income generating activities uh, that they can do. And then we shall send our technical people to go and uh, train them. But unless something is done, these prostitutes pose a huge threat to society. And if not checked, the rest of new HIV infections will correspondingly escalate leading to a vicious cycle of sorts. Samuel Sanono, UBC News.